Oh, what's up, everybody? Effort Joe here. Uh, Tuesday, uh, Obama won the election, and I uh, had a friend who was mad because she wanted Mitt Romney to win where the rich can get away by sitting on their ass and not paying taxes, and she really wanted to say if she got raped by, if she got raped, it's not rape, it's consensual sex. That's what she wants, but she wanted Romney, but no, but it's like it's uh, Obama won, and she did not, she does not like Obama because she thinks just because your name is different that makes you Muslim. Like she thinks, if I, she thinks it's like it, she thinks Obama's a Muslim because his name is Obama, which she doesn't know that his father is Muslim and his mother's not, not knowing that the guy is biracial. Because she's passing judgment on his name, so it, on his name and his father, so that makes, you know, and I thought it was kind of wrong for her to for her to pass judgment on a man because of his name, even if his religion, like he's a colored person, and you passing judgment on him because of his name, even if he was Muslim, who cares? Like, and it's kind of funny, Muhammad Ali, Malcolm X. Louis Farrakhan, three Muslims I just named off. But she has a problem with Obama. Why is that Muhammad Ali, Malcolm X, and uh, Louis Farrakhan are not getting the same kind of hate as Obama's getting, even though Obama's not even a Muslim. He grew up in a church. He loves Jesus. He reads the Holy Bible, so how does that make him Muslim? But and that's all she cared about was passing judgment on this man because of his name so I got sick and tired I say you know what screw this people getting on my nerves about this so I wrote a status I said listen here I'm gonna post the status that I posted on Tuesday because she because this girl her name is Amy and she got I'm putting her name in her name is Amy she got pissed off because what I post on Tuesday I said listen here Obama's not a Muslim stop being such a racist ass to a man that was given a Muslim name Obama Obama's father is Muslim not Obama nobody bitched about Arnold Schwarzenegger running um, should have put run but rang Cali but when he we get a mixed person in the White House. That's when people become a big ass racist to him. Don't say you ain't a racist. If you wasn't a racist, you wouldn't be bitching about Obama and his name. So stop being such a hypocrite to Obama. You can't say you you got black friends, but be hanging on a man that is that is colored. If you get mad because I post this. Let me read that part again. If you get mad because I post this as my status, it shows how much of a racist you are. And I post that Tuesday. I posted to This is Amy. I posted to, my, to Tuesday. This is Amy. She gets pissed off. I'm going to show you what she said. I thought, okay. I didn't say her name in the status. I don't know what the fuck happened. But she got butt hurt over what was said. Now, this girl gets mad at me for saying stop being such a racist ass to a man that is of color that's been given a, 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 a Muslim name. But you got three famous people, Malcolm X, uh, Malcolm X, uh, Muhammad Ali and Louis Farrakhan, three Muslims, and ain't nobody bitched about it except back in the day in the 50s, 30s, 40s, and 50s, about the skin color, but not their religion. <laughs> but today, she's bitching about his his name, his religion, and his skin color. That's kind of wrong. Oh, he's oh he's color. He 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 a Muslim, and his name is Obama. He's Muslim and his name is Obama. That is racist to a person because their name is different from yours and their religion. That is racist in the eyes. It is racism right there. If you, oh, he's a Catholic. Okay, that's racist towards Catholics. Oh, he's a Baptist. Oh, that's racism towards Baptist people or Jewish people. 
Hebrews. Oh, he's a he, oh he's a Hebrew. Jesus is a Hebrew, so you're racist against Jesus. That's how it is. Racism, it really, if you hate on a religion that is same as hating on a colored person, that is racism. She is picking, she is getting mad at Obama because his name is Obama, a Muslim name. And she's getting mad because he's back in office. Do you hate his name or his color so fucking badly that you, like, this girl doesn't know what the fuck's she's talking about <laughs> so when I put that status that last part says if you get pissed off because cause I posted this as my status to show how much of a racist you are I wanted to do two, uh, do this video Tuesday but uh, a friend was watching that told me not to so see Tuesday Afro see look listen here Obama is not a Muslim stop being such a racist ass to a man this game was giving a Muslim like okay now you see that now this is funny like I said in this status is nobody bitched Arnold Schwarzenegger for being governor of California and he's not even from the US but he's married to Kennedy nobody bitched about him running for governor but people can bitch about a colored person with a Muslim name that is fucked up and racism right there in the basket you let a man that's not even from this country run California, but when it comes down to a color person, you want to bitch about his name and his religion. That's fucked up. And y'all can say, oh, no, they, no, no, that's racism, no matter what. If you can let somebody from another country run a, run a, run a state, but bitch about a color person. If you can sit there and let a person from another country run a state in the U.S., but bitch about a color person run the whole country, and you are racist in a way so you see that I wrote I wrote this now I'm going to show you what she says like, like see Amy Amy here really you think I'm a racist now ha <laughs> ha now look at it this again if you get mad because I post this as my status it shows how much of a racist you are like if someone posts this uh, status up in the description box no names was mentioned but she you really really you think I'm a racist ha ha that's fuck, fucking funny to me like I said he shouldn't have gotten another term that fucker shouldn't have been in the White House again I don't like she didn't even say his name or spell it boomer probably never will but really get I really don't give a fuck if you think I'm a racist which I never called her racist she did that to herself when you out yourself as a racist because one thing is other friends that I've talked to you'll see other friends I've talked to and they saw what I posted up and there's blacks white other minorities and they look at that and they said the same thing you didn't say her name but she outed herself and she called herself a racist even I said that she said you don't have to worry about seeing seeing any of my posts about him because you're officially deleted. Delete me. I don't give a fuck. But I didn't call you a racist. That's one fucking thing. You did that to yourself. You wanted people to know that you was a racist. And I put, I ain't gonna shut up. I'm sick of people being such an asshole to him because of his name and where his. I should have put where his father's from. And I posted. I didn't call you a racist. You called yourself a racist. So you can't blame me for outing yourself on that. Then she gets mad. Okay, I'm a racist. I admit it. That's why my boyfriend is black. Now, I'm going to say this. Uh, like a friend of mine told me. She said her boy. She, let me show you again. She says, this is Amy. That's her picture. Amy Hill. I'm not a racist. Yeah, I'm a racist. I admit it. That's why my boyfriend is boyfriend's black right doesn't matter if your boyfriend's black you can still be a fucking racist towards people that's how it is doesn't matter if your boyfriend's black white Chinese Asian or whatever you can still be a fucking racist that is just stupid you still making your you still making yourself look stupid as fuck you was not making yourself look any better. Yeah, my boyfriend's black. But you have a problem with color people. 
have a you know you have a problem with a person that's color and it's got a Muslim name. You still out yourself like as a racist. I'm not calling you racist. You're out at yourself on that part. I'm, I'm like I said, I'm gonna post the status in the fucking description box. And so she calls me such an idiot. She calls me an idiot because she outed herself as a racist. Because I said, and look at all these people liking that status. Black, look, liking the status. Black person. White person, white people, other names, blacks and whites, and it's other minorities liking what the hell I have to say because I'm tired of of people dogging the shit out of Obama because he's another different minority. Now this girl, <coughs> I'm gonna post the link to her Facebook page because, like I said, I didn't call her black. I didn't know I didn't call her racist. And I, I'm going to show you one more thing because this is funny how she thought this whole status was about her. Dude, I know you made this status about me. You should, you were just commenting on my other status and I put, I put up so you don't have to say I am. I know you was think, you, I know you think I am. I ain't never had any problems. Look, man, you don't like, look, you don't know what the fuck I'm thinking. That's for one damn thing. Get that shit out your system. Get that shit out your system. I never... I never... You don't know what the fuck I'm thinking for you to pass judgment on me. You called... You called yourself racist. I didn't call you racist. Nobody on... that commented on that status called you racist. You did that to yourself to get attention. You thought that that whole post was about you, which it was not. Which it was not. You wanted people to call you a racist. And that's what you wanted. Oh, my boyfriend's black. Just because your boyfriend, like I said, like my friend said, just because your boyfriend's black does still, just because your boyfriend's black. You can still be a racist. That's how it is. You can still be a racist towards your own kind to other minorities. You're a white girl and you sitting up there getting pissed off because nobody called you a racist name. Nobody called you racist, but you got pissed on and called yourself racist. And you mad about that. You mad about that. And even I, and I even even friends like God sat there and said, called you a fucking racist because what you put. Say they even said that that I didn't call you a racist, but you outed yourself, so you called yourself a racist. I didn't call you a racist, but you called yourself a racist. And I'm a, I'm gonna show y'all this because it's just funny. It says, did anyone see me call Amy Hill a racist? Fuck no. Nah. But it's fucked up how you can call a person that is mixed a Muslim. And that's how it is. Barack Obama is mixed. His mother is white. His father is black. That doesn't make him something that he's not. So every mixed person is a is a Muslim. Okay, Mariah Carey's a Muslim. Holly Berry's a Muslim. Derek Jeter's a Muslim. Fucking Tiger Woods a Muslim. Jessica Alba is a Muslim. Lenny Kravitz a Muslim. Amy Hill thinks that mixed people are Muslims because how she treats Obama. She calls, she labels him as a Muslim. So every mixed person across this nation is a fucking Muslim to Amy Hill. And that's bullshit. Because Obama's got a Muslim name. His dad gave him his name, but his mother raised him in the U.S. So they cannot make him a fucking Muslim if he doesn't sit there and practice Islam he doesn't read from the Quran just because he went to college and studied Muslims doesn't make him a Muslim because he doesn't practice Islam that doesn't make him a Muslim so get that shit so going to so going to school getting an education makes you a Muslim so if that's how people think that getting an education from school 
makes you a Muslim, then everybody in this fucking country is a fucking Muslim. If studying something makes you one. And there's and after I put put that up and look, my friend, my friend didn't see you personally call out that Joe, so the answer is no. Friends sat there and said didn't see me call her uh racist. Even my friend Kayla, I didn't see anywhere in the post or comments that says that Amy is a racist, so shut the fuck up. All this bullshit. My friends didn't see that post that I said. And these are white people backing me up. Dude, I know you made this status about me. You were see, look, like I said, I didn't make this status about you, but you thought it was about you. See, she out is. That's how it is. I didn't call you a racist. You called yourself a racist. I'm sitting up there wondering why. You trying to get everybody to kiss your ass saying I'm the bad guy, but you're the one sitting up there calling mixed people Muslims. And that's how it is, man. You're the one calling every mixed person Muslim because their name is different from yours. I didn't call you racist. You called yourself racist. Just because you're dating a black man still doesn't mean that you're that it makes any different. Oh, that you're dating a black person and makes you not racist. For real, you can still be a racist by dating a black man. That doesn't stop you from being racist. Oh, I'm dating a black man, but I'm not racist. But but you said and said some racist shit about a mixed person, so. How does that not make you not a racist? You tell me. Anybody can tell me. Tell me this, ladies and gentlemen. I'm I'm kind of confused. This girl sitting walking around Facebook and talking about she's not a racist, but she hates on hate calls every Muslim person Muslim. That's fucked up, man. Maybe Jessica. Maybe I should walk up to Jessica Adams and say, "Hey, man, there's a white girl down in Georgia. Thanks you, I'm fucking Muslim." Or maybe I should walk up to Mariah Carey. Mariah Carey say, "Hey, there's a bitch named Amy Hill. Thanks you're fucking Muslim. You're Muslim. Let's go to read the Quran." Just because you date a different minority from yourself doesn't make you any better of a person. I'm for real. You ought to, because you need to grow up, little girl. You need to grow the fuck up, man. That status was never about you, but you took it upon yourself and got butt hurt over something I said that was never for you. You can walk around wherever. You can sit there and call the popos if you fucking want. They can't do a motherfucking thing because you were stupid enough to think that a status was about you, which it wasn't. Your name wasn't mentioned. Your address wasn't given out. Uh, your, your, your sexual preference wasn't given out. Nothing about you. Your information was nothing. It was not given out. But you took it upon yourself to make that whole situation about you. You made that whole situation, whole situation about you because you ain't got no attention. Look, I'm gonna tell y'all this. This is how fucked up it is. Now she does. Now she goes on these sites like X Hamster. She goes. She goes on that land, live cam shit. She goes under. Uh, what, what, what's the name? She goes for black. Uh, white for black. White for black, and she go on. Another site called Person.com, or she go on Justin T, just just Cam's TV. These are the places she goes to. I'm giving that out, but this is fucked up. How you sit there and out at yourself and want to turn the whole situation on somebody else, even though you started this whole situation. If you would have left that status alone, if you would have sat there and read it correctly, instead of jumping to conclusion and calling somebody a Muslim or jumping to conclusion where you think somebody called you a name, 
it's not now I wrote another status after that and I thought of, as I was writing this other status it was something that popped in my head that you know I, I love watching Medea movies and there was something that Medea said and I'm going to say this to this Amy Hill girl Amy Hill it's like this it's not what people cause you it's what you answer to I didn't call you racist but you answer to it that makes you a racist like I'm going to say it again it's not what people call you it's what you answer to if you answer to the word bitch that makes you a bitch if you answer to the name hoe that makes you a hoe whatever name you answer to that's what you are I didn't call you a racist but you answer to the word racist so that clearly makes you a racist you could have sat there and say who's he talk who's he calling racist that would have been a who that would have been the thing I would have said I'm if she would have asked who she was who was I calling racist I would have said the people who keeps thinking he was Muslim those are the people who are racist towards him but I didn't call you racist I didn't say you wear a bed sheet and a pillowcase. I didn't say you like to burn crosses in black folks' yards. All I said was the people who thinks he's Muslim are racist. But do not get butt hurt because I didn't call you a name. Don't get butt hurt because Obama won the election. Politics is very fucked up. Your vote really doesn't matter, but you get butt hurt because a color person is in office. But you date a color person, that's kind of odd. You hate a color person that's in office, but you date a color person. That that don't make no fucking sense. You hate the color person in the off White House, but you date a color person. Either I'm, like, either something wrong with me or something wrong with this girl. Like, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to do like this. I'm going to put the stat, I'm going to put her Facebook link in the in description box. If y'all go to her, if y'all go message her, don't sit up there and cyber bully her. Please, whatever you do, don't cyber bully her. Just tell her like it is with her and tell her that, tell, just tell her like it is what you think. Because like I said, I didn't call her racist. She called herself racist. It was stupid enough for her to do that. It was stupid enough for her to do that because one thing is, like I said, nobody's name was brought up. I didn't say your name, I didn't call you a racist, but you called yourself a racist, that was on you. That was your issue. You wanted the attention, you wanted people to kiss your ass. You wanted everybody to notice you. I wrote the status because I was so tired of people being such a racist bastard to Obama because of his name. I got tired of people getting mad at him because of his skin color is mixed and y'all still set up here and play that bullshit call he's Muslim that's a racist remark because y'all keep thinking he's something that he's not I did not know going to church praising Jesus name in church reading the holy bible makes you a fucking Muslim <coughs> excuse me but it is what it is <sighs> like I said You outed yourself, Amy Hill. You did. You did that. Now, this has been Afro Joe Tan. I can tell you is again. But it's true. Because one thing is, I always tell people, watch how you set yourself up, man. People are always outing themselves. She outed herself. She made herself look like a racist. I didn't make her look like a racist. She made herself look like, self look like a racist. And that's how it is, man. That's how it is. So, Amy Hill, I'm not calling you a racist because you called yourself a racist, so you're the racist. Not me, not the next person in line. You're the racist because you're the one that took offense to it. You're the one that labored yourself a racist. You're the one thinking just because you date black men that you can get away by saying anything doesn't matter if you date a black, white, Hispanic, you still can be a racist no matter what. That's how it is. This 
this is this has been Afro Joe. Follow me on Twitter at Afro Joe Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Jr. 2, CeeLo Jr. 3. Holla at me. Peace, love, and so. Like I said, man, I'm going to put her a Facebook link in the description box. Just go over there and leave her good, a nice message. Don't go over there and threaten her and shit. Or say, I'm going to kick your ass nothing. But tell her like it is, man. Because like I said, I didn't call her a racist. She did it herself. Like I said, peace, love, and so.